Hello everybody, welcome back to Greenwood Girl Cards. It is Friday night and uh, I am coming on to do a video that I had hoped to post yesterday. Um, I had told you guys that uh, my friend Beatrice Jennings, Betty, um, for short, she goes by Betty, uh, she offered me a coupon code for all of you to use during the month of May. So um, now you know Irala Miha Shop on Etsy makes the most beautiful um, digital printouts that you can use and uh, you know that I use her papers and her sentiments quite a bit this is a new sentiment sheet that she did this one is called shabby sentiments number two and it's a collage sheet and it's Irala Miha shop and there's her Etsy address so you go to etsy.com slash forward slash shop forward slash Irala Miha's Irala Miha shop okay and uh, so that one's called Shabby Sentiment, Sentiments Number Two. This one is called Collage, okay? And it's Fancy Ephemera, all right? I love this one. I love these beautiful takes that are in here. They're really sweet. And then she has a lot of different little things. The Love and Joy is adorable. And uh, just a little to and from tag. There's Enjoy and Greetings. There's this little um, butterfly ticket this little rose ticket. There's some little emblems that you can use, different types of metal um, embellishments you can trim out and use. So really, really fun. Um, and then the two that are my favorite, of course, because I use a lot of digital papers, I love this one here. And this one has four different shades. There's a blue toned rose, a tea dyed kind of rose color. This one is actually a light green. And then this one is pink, and this one is called Petite Flowers Number no. Two. Okay, and it's a collage of four card fronts, basically, or however you want to use them. And then this one is uh, would be wonderful for journals um, or any type of uh, you know any type of pattern paper use that you might have, whether scrapbooking or whatever. Um, I use it, of course, for card making. Um, but this one is Fancy Ephemera also. So, and I think, if I remember, I don't know if these two came together or separate. I can't remember now. Um, I think I got them all separate. But go to her shop, and you can certainly find all of these at her Etsy shop, and you'll be able to tell um, what you're getting based on her pictures for each of her listings. Um, but this is the code that she gave us. It's all capital letters, Jill May 2022, but you're just going to put Jill May 22, okay? And it's valid from May 5th to May 30th, and you're getting a 15% off discount from her entire store. Sometimes it's just a limited amount of sale items. This time it's her whole store. So 15% off any item that you want in her store, okay? So the entire store is on sale. Again, that code is Jill May 22. Okay, so these are the beautiful files that uh, she gifted to me to create with, and I am so excited um, to, to be using these this month. I've already started using them. If you watch Saturday Morning Makes uh, last weekend, I used this file to make those circle cards. These were the four papers that I was using um, to layer behind the circle cards, uh, the polka dot circle cards that I made for Mother's Day. So beautiful papers to use any time of the year. And what's also wonderful, um, I wanna talk a little bit about printing papers. I've had a lot of questions recently, a lot of instant messages asking about how I print and what do I print on. So I wanna talk a little bit about printing things. Um, a lot of people don't realize this, but when you have a color printer, um, it's very important to use the right paper. You're gonna get this type, this better type of result if you use a paper that is made for printing uh, color prints. And uh, I learned this from my friend P. Hello, P. I'm thinking of you. And also from my friend Susan Laverty. Hello, Susan. Hello, Mike. Um, and to your family. Uh, I learned a lot about that just from talking with both of them. But um, Epson does a sale at their website periodically where they put their papers on 50% off, and that's when I order them. They do free shipping several times a year, and they also put them on sale for 50% off. And I usually just go on and I place an order and I stock up. And uh, this paper um, premium is Premium Presentation Paper Matte. 
and I want you to see it because it has two sides and you're probably not going to be able to tell on camera but one side has a more yellowish tone to it and the other side is very white and in my printer I want the white side to be what print what it prints on so I put it in with the yellow side facing up and then when the way my printer feeds is like this and so then it prints onto the white side okay so um, you do need to pay attention to that because the side that prints is the one that is white and the side that you don't want to print on is is more of a yellowish tone and you can tell when you get the paper and there's instructions about that on the inside um, they give you a sheet of uh, documentation that explains about the paper inside the box and uh, so the paper we print on is very important if you're going to do digital papers um, you do want to use the proper type of paper um, when you're doing an actual print um, so that's that's something that I get asked a lot about and then the other thing that people ask me all the time is what is my printer I use an Epson XP 6100 right now I am very interested in getting the Epson Echotake printer and um, that's a printer that a friend of mine has and she has recommended and it has enough ink to last an entire year of prints for most people for the average person um, and my friend really likes it so my next purchase will be that printer that was the one I tried to get when I went to get this one when my other printer broke I used to have an Epson I think it was an A300 or something or 833 I forget um, but I tried to get the Echo Tank printer and it was on back stock and they had no idea when it was going to be in coming in and this was during COVID so I had to buy what they had and this is what they had in stock. So I got this printer. I'm really liking it. It's a wonderful printer. And that is what I printed these beautiful digital papers on using this Epson uh, premium presentation paper mat. So um, I know that there's a lot of people that aren't familiar with digitals. Digitals are from Betty Shop are very easy to order and download. You literally receive... Um, you go back to your Etsy shop after your order's completed and you can go to your purchases and click on the purchase and it'll say download files. You click download files and then it will save the file to your computer and then you just go to the file, open it and hit print and this prints out for you. Um, and of course you want to use the right printer in your printer paper or you can load, save these onto a, uh, you know, a little disk drive. Um, uh, you know a stick drive if you will and you can take them to some place like um, you know any copy place in your neighborhood that does printing so any printer or copy place Kinko's copies for example which I think is now FedEx Kinko's um, you can order them online that way you can send the files to them in an email and they and order what you want or go to their website and order it and attach the files and they'll mail you the prints back so there's it's not a very hard thing to do um, it takes some time to get used to it, but digital files are very easy to use. And what I do like about them is you don't have to store all sorts of paper pads in your house. You just have them on the disk drive and on your computer. So um, that's just a little bit about using digitals. I'm very um, honored that Betty asked me to design for with her for this month to be a guest designer for a Rala Miha shop. And I love these beautiful files and uh, all of the lovely sentiments in this one here. Um, look at those joys right there. You know I'll be using those. <laughs> I love the beautiful papers that she shared. Um, these greens and pinks and light blues and tea colors are so pretty. And, uh, and then this one is so much fun because it has so much ephemera that you can use on your projects. So Betty, thank you so much uh, for doing this for all of my subscribers here at Greenwood Girl Cards. And uh, again, I'm just gonna remind you guys of this beautiful code, Jill May 22 for 15% off her whole store from May 5th to the 30th. So don't miss this. Um, this is a wonderful thing that she's doing. I hope that you guys will stay tuned as I continue to share projects using these beautiful files throughout the month of May. All right, everybody, I'll be back with you uh, very soon to share some things, all right? Bye-bye.